Okay, dear students, let us see what is there in this question. The refractive index of glass is given as 3 by 2 and the refractive of index of water is given as 4 by 3. Um, what is the critical angle for light traveling from glass to water? So it means like, let us say there is uh, this glass slab here and there is water on the surface now. And uh, on the surface like this, the light is now hitting this surface like this and it must go like this because only then I can say that uh, the light is hitting at the critical angle. So this will be theta critical and this angle is now 90 degree. Okay, so refractive index I can write. So I can just call it like mu2 and this is mu1 because our incident light is coming from glass. That is why I call it mu1. Okay, so what is the critical angle for the light traveling from glass to water? Critical angle means that this topic is from total internal reflection and in that topic, what is our condition? That this angle should be 90 degrees. So I am just applying Snell's law at the point P and what is the Snell's law? That is mu1 sine theta critical is equal to mu2 sine 90 degree because that is what is the definition of theta critical. So sine 90 is 1. So sine of theta critical is mu2 divided by mu1. And uh, okay, so mu2 will be uh, in uh, for water that is 4 by 3. I'm just substituting the values here. 4 by 3 divided by 3 by 2. So it is 4 by 3 multiplied by 2 by 3. So it comes out to be 8 by 9 and hence theta critical is sine inverse 8 by 9. And on comparing, we get that the answer for this question is D. So this is how we do this question. And my dear students, this is Professor Varun. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you have any doubts regarding this video, please mention that in the comment section. All the best. Bye.